Welcome everyone, Gracier Gang here, Ryan Gracier as always, we are back with uh, some more Masters 25, this is the second half of, or this is the second box on the, on the half, so we bought a full case, and the full case comes with two, it comes with two boxes that have two boxes each, so you get four boxes total, it's a little annoying, I get it, but this is the second box that was in the side of the other box, and uh, hopefully we get a little bit better pulls than we did last week. Last week was a little depressing. Um, but you know what? We get what we pay for. And I mean, well, actually, you, you know, just what? We'll just, just open the packs. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. We'll see what we get. I'm all I'm all for cards I don't already have. Plus, these watermarks are pretty cool. Let's go into it. What do we got? Let's, uh, hold on. I need to... Let me tilt this up just a smidge. Come on. Oh my god, I locked the ball on the camera. There we go. Okay, cool. All right, let's see. All right, here we go. Simic Spirit Guide. Fiend Hunter. Quicksand. Oh, Flooded Grove off the bat. All right, okay. I'm cool with that. And a foil. Oh, Nick's Lee's Ram. Okay. Yeah, I'm cool with the Flooded Grove. Like, you don't have to tell me. <laughs> Mishra's Factory. Okay. Ert, uh, Utopia Sprawl. Pyroclasm. Vindicate. Okay. Nice. I'm digging the Vindicate. Yeah, so people have always asked, like, what is this? And it's the Weatherlight destroying another ship. So, uh, like, I kind of saw that, like, pretty much when I first saw it. I was like, at first I was like, oh, uh, it kind of looks like an X-Wing or a TIE Fighter. But then I looked at it a little bit closer and I was like, oh, yeah, that's the weather light. I didn't even really play in that era. I just sort of know the story a little bit, but not a lot. Like, I don't know a lot, too much about it. Exclude Watch Wolf, Ravish Chupacabra, Mystic Snake. All right, it's worth, like, a buck. 83 cents. Sift. Oh, that skeleton's back. Oh, man, I'm pulling it from the wrong stack. Mm -hmm. La, la, la. So many coming. So much coming. Undead Gladiator. Ash Barons. Mm -hmm. Murder of Crows. Uh, oh, we got uh, another Darien King. Cool. Plummets. And Gavin Token. No Jace so far. See, I have one Jace from Eternal Masters, um, but I would like more Jaces. I'm not all, ooh, Savannah Lions. A foil Jace would be great. What is that? Okay, yeah, Goblin War Drums. Murder of Crows, Will-O-Wisp, and Blood Moon. All right, I don't actually own a Blood Moon. Foil White Mane Lion. Ooh, and a Standak Twin. Yeah, cool. It's a rare, too. Not a mythic. That's like uh, 20 bucks, I think. Blood Moon? What's Blood Moon worth? Let me grab that real quick. Ah, 20 bucks. Yeah, just like I said. Cool. Oh, box two, or the second box on this half is not bad, Brainstorm. Okay. Pillowy, Pillory of the Sleepless. Heavy Arbalest. Genyu of the Spires. Rugged Prairie. Nice. See, I already have Rugged Prairie in... Um, one of my commander decks, but I, d I could definitely use it in uh, uh, at least one or two of my other commander decks, so nice. Happy with that. Foil Skeleton Eyes, okay, and a Wolf Token. Yeah, Rugged Prairie is nice. I'm digging that. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, here we go. Zombify. Regrowth. Karnar Zealots, and <laughs> Snaring Bridge. Nice. First Mythic of the Box, and a Foil Will-O-Wisp. A little faded on the black foil there. Uh, Snare Bridge, 35 bucks. Cool, first mythic, all right. Not bad. Watch, we're gonna get the tree of redemption. Or is it, oh, yeah, I think it's redemption. Do, do, do. Blue Elemental Blast. Fallen Angel, I like Fallen Angel. Invigorate, okay, Biden of Thassa. Mm, eh. Ruthless Ripper. And a Spirit Token. Let's keep on going. <laughs> Watch Wolf, Cavu Predator, Lightning Bolt, nice. Nicol Bolas again. 
Mm. Whoa, what the hell? <laughs> what? Look at this. I got a nickel bolus and a foil nickel bolus in the same pack. That's pretty freaking spicy right there. I have no idea how much foil nickel bolus is worth. It can't be worth a ton. But, uh, yeah, well, you know, I'll, I'll probably I'll probably check that at the end. We'll just see how much that's worth. Because uh, regular nickel bolus ain't worth a lot. But foil nickel bolus might be worth like a fiver. Maybe more, who knows. But that <laughs> that's pretty cool to get a, the foil and non-foil in the same pack. La, la, la. Ishan Shade, Caustic Tar, The Open Fist, Acromos Vengeance. Six mana, destroy artifacts, creatures, and enchantments, or you can say, oh, you know what, I, I like, I need more board wipes in EDH, so let's go for it. Full Erg Raiders. Nice. Nice, nice. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Here we go. Oh, Congregate. The Polymorphist, the Mystic, the Mystic Queen. Oh, I thought, I thought it was Nicol Bolas. <laughs> I was like, I got a Conflux. I was like, another Nicol Bolas? Or a Mancer. All right. So in Iconic Masters, I really wanted to pull Lord of the Pit. I didn't. Uh, and I, I just, I haven't, I haven't decided if I'm going to buy a Lord of the Pit or not as a single. Um, I'll probably just pick it up somewhere. Blightning. Uh, the Cavern, Mirrored Landscape, and Ocean Thief. Hmm, notionally boring. Uh, Nettle Sentinel Foil, all right. I bet you Ocean Thief's not bad. I just, yeah. It's not a card I'm not really into black-blue. I might make a black-blue deck here in a bit, but I'm not 100% sure what I want to do. Cross and Colossus, Brian Elemental, Cloud Blazer, oh, another Elodamry's Cat. Oh, nice. And a Dust Legion Zealot from R Rivals of the Carfoil. Okay. Q. Oh, I got an itch. It's right here. Oh. oh. It's my, it's my pulling apart hands for my packs. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Core Firewalker. Herbis Protector. The Falls. Hoo hoo. Another Corsair Crufix. And a Foil Pillage. Mm -hmm. And that angel. Nice. Nice. Uh, went, hung out, hung out at the park today. Got to check out the cherry blossoms. It's pretty nice. Pretty nice, pretty nice. Of course, by the time you're watching this video, cherry blossoms will probably be gone. Uh, the cavern, zombify, promise Benu, and is it chemister? All right. Hmm. All right. And a foil exclude and a silver token. Ooh, we got one stack left on box two. We got some okay stuff. We still got plenty of time. Broodwatch, Nantuku, Enthralling Victor, Iron Shaman, and who Animar! Nice! Uh, Animar is worth a cool $14. I don't have an Animar, so I'm cool with that. And a Wild Heart Invoker Foil. Nice. I don't know if I want to make an Animar deck, though. I like fighting against Animar. See if I can beat the clock. I don't know if I want to make an Animar deck though. Let's make a Morph Animar deck. That'd be cool. I saw, I saw one of those online. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool list idea. Make an Animar deck that actually has no creatures in it. Just be like, nah, I'm just, just trying to trick you. Swiftfoot Boots, Humble Defector, Herbus Protector, Acroma Angel of Wrath. So I know Acroma Angel of Wrath is not worth a lot, but I don't have one, so I'm cool with it. L uh, Laurel, Lacroix, it, it, it's, it's a false snake. Oh, I put it in the wrong pile. Wrong pile foil snake you got over there. But yeah, flying, first strike, vigilance, trample, haste picks for black and red. I'm not bad. Uh, you know, I'm not down with the acroma. I mean, I'm not against acroma. I'm cool with acroma. Where's she? Mythic. Three mythics already? Okay. Crosin <laughs> Colossal, or Colossus, Invigorate. Getting with the Spires and Stryonic Resonator. Probably Foil Savannah Lions. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. I wonder how wonder how much that Foil Savannah Lions will fetch. I mostly just trade or sell my foils off. I don't really keep foils. I don't need the foils to play the game, but I know a lot of people do enjoy them, so I'm not going to deny them the trade. Curse Catcher, B um, Baloth Null. Rancor and rest in peace. 
Uh, Court Hussar. Yeah, Rest in Peace got that sweet, like, inf- or instant mill combo with Rest in Peace and Helm of Obedience. It's pretty sweet. Stack overflow. What are we going to get out of this box? Wait, what was that? Oh, okay. I thought, I thought it was a different card. I was like, I didn't know that card was in here. Uh, Heavy Arabalist. I can't say that right. Deadly Design, Will-O-Wisp, and Fetid Heath. Who oh, nice. This is like 12 bucks. Nice. I'm down with Fetid Heath. I'm cool with it. I'm liking it. It might go in one of my, my vampire deck, maybe. Wooly Loxodon, Foil, and a Spirit Token. 1-1. One, one. That's a creepy Spirit Token. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Enthralling Victor, Quicksilver Daggler, Shia of, oh, of Shambu, and uh, one of the other things, the uh, Center of the Sea. Cool. Always cool to have extras. Foil Retraction Helix. Mm-hmm. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, there's the Curse Catcher. Brian Elemental, Shadow Mage Infiltrator, and Thalia, Garden of Th- Guardian of Thraben. So I do not have a Thalia. I don't I don't have this Thalia. So now I got it. Cool. Humble Defector Foil and an Elf Warrior token. Two packs left. No Jace. So far. No Jace, no Imperial Recruiter. Mm. Deadly Design. Ancient Stirrings, Merfolk Leader, and Rat Catcher. And a Foil Kindle. Hmm. Last pack of the box. Mm-hmm-hmm. Here we go. Simic Spirit Guide, Fiend Hunter, Ordian of Heliod, and Magus of the Wheel. And a Foil Relentless Rats. Not bad. Okay. So, we got... And Snaring Bridge is like the highest. Uh, we didn't got no Jace, we got no Chalice, and we got no Imperial Recruiter yet from the first two boxes. Um, yeah. Let's look up that foil. What's the price on that foil? Where is it? Hold on. Let me pull up the list here. Give me a half a second, ladies and gents, boys and girls. Children of all ages. What are you doing? Go Masters 25 foils. Foil Nickel Bolus is worth 22 bucks. All right. I'm cool with that. I don't know what non-foil nickel bolus is worth. It's probably worth like a dollar. Let's see what let's see what non good old nickel bolus. What is this? Is he the I'm assuming he's the deceiver. No, just regular nickel bolus. What is regular nickel bolus worth? I mean, Matt, oh, 279. Alright. Non-foil is worth 279. Foil is worth 22 bucks. Cool. All right. Anyways, uh, yeah. So we got Snaring Bridge is so far the highest valued card we pulled out of all the boxes so far. Animar is pretty cool, and I don't, I don't have a Chroma, so I'm cool with the Chroma. Uh, let's see. Out of these ones, that's pretty decent. That's not bad. Fetid, he's sweet. Hmm. I can't get a bunch of these. Eldrama's Cal is pretty cool. I like it under conflicts. Uh, no, no. Dip, dip, dip. Rugged Prairie is good. Blood Moon's good. Vindicate's cool. Flood of Grove's cool. All right, cool. Yeah. Let's get into it. Uh, I mean, let's keep on going. Hope you guys enjoyed your... Hope you guys have a great week and see you all next week. Goodbye.